Queen DJ. And in today's video, I will be reacting really to episode one of Loving Yamada Kun to level 999. Okay. <laughs> I mean, you know, out of all the titles, I. Mm, no, it's not the weirdest title. I, I mean, but it, it is definitely out there. I mean, damn. But um, don't know nothing about this show. Saw it like literally while I was looking at all the shows that I was gonna be watching. And I was like, yeah, I'm gonna watch this. This looks cute as fuck. And of course, you know, it's an adult romance series. And yeah, I'm a sucker for those. Mm-hmm. I mean <laughs> Other than that, let's go ahead and get started with episode one in three, two, one, go. I literally stopped watching a video just to start this. <laughs> hmm? Oh, hell. Uh, oh, boy, you're so mean. That's fucked up, though. Be like, sir, damn, out of all the ways that you, you take her out, you know, you show her a good time, good old grand time. And you're like, hey, it's not you, it's me. The fuck is wrong with you? Hey, Cody. <laughs> oh. Can you get out? Yeah. You're getting there. <laughs> Damn. Damn. Oh. Just say, could you put the shirt, sir? No, I'm gonna be a depressed person for the rest of my life. Oh my god, he cheated on me with a girl in a game. What am I supposed to do? Depression. Oh, yes, Windows. I want to get exposed or oh, drop out. Aww. Oh, we are really up for it. <laughs> mm. 
me playing Genshin. <laughs> Mm -hmm. Okay, free to play. We like that, even though sometimes I'm a pink player. You gonna say anything? Nothing? Oh, there we go. Is that a way to actually do it? <laughs> right? <laughs> Oh, God. <laughs> Ma'am, not the coffee, not the tea. Mm. Oh, and pain codes, of course, we need the codes, need those. Mm. You get very, like, not great as primo gems, and then you do freaking gotcha, and then it's like, no, fuck you, you don't get anything! I I kinda know. <laughs> I mean, but hey, it'd be a good opportunity. That's when you go up and be like, fuck you. Like, yes, you lost the best thing in your life. Oh. 
that also just reminds me that I literally forgot. My dumbass literally forgot. I know that feeling too, baby. <laughs> but I forgot. Pin code for freaking catching. Sadness. Well, but thank God it was a primo gem, so, but still. Sadness. Oh. Why gotta be a girl with big eyes, fucking lips? What the fuck? Freaking perfect. <laughs> oh. Yeah, yeah, that's him. 100%. Yep. Why he gotta be so pretty? <laughs> Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. <laughs> no, I think you got the right guy. Wait, like, damn, what is your problem? Yeah. <laughs> you want that right? <laughs> yeah, it sure is. <laughs> like yes, uh, a win. Ha ha I'm in 
hell? Please, yes. I, can I have a beer? Even though I don't like beer like that? Yeah. Oh, you shut up. Not with them big behind lips. Oh my god, like seriously, next thing you know we're gonna see BBLs in anime. Yes! I thought you were going to say something else, but it's okay. I mean, did you not realize how pretty you are, sir? Damn. True. Yeah, I mean, mm. Is he gonna be at the door? I'm, bruh, if he is, goodbye. Goodbye. <laughs> Right? I mean, we knew what's gonna happen.
Aww. I'm screaming inside. I sure am. She about to get like super drunk. <laughs> it's okay, I know that feeling too. Damn, oh, God, so jealous. <laughs> Right? I mean, how much did you drink last night? Like, oh my god, what the fuck happened last night? Oh my god. <laughs> this is what happens, and also why you know your limit. You don't over drink. But yeah, sometimes when you're feeling a certain type of way, yes! That is when you can purge. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yes, even though next thing you know you're going to be hungover as fuck, and then you probably have to go to work. Thank God this never happened to me, though. I, I mean, I've gotten drunk. <laughs> yeah. To the point where I've woken up the next morning being like, what did I do last night? It, it, it's also worse when I'm on Twitter. Do not, <laughs> do not be on Twitter when I am drunk on Twitter. <laughs> I feel like that is when bad ish on me will really happen and then I wake up and I'm like oh I really tweeted that because I felt like there was one time I possibly was going to confess somebody that I had a crush on them but I was like no I can't do that <laughs> <laughs> even with that liquid courage no but really okay so first thoughts on this this is really cute I mean yes it does give me feels to like every other adultist anime romance series that I've seen um from you know the previous one in the previous season all the way to a recovery of MMO junkie in a way I mean how I got a lot of recovery of MMO junkies feeling towards this when I saw the poster and then initiative everything else but yeah yeah don't don't you hate that mmm Oh, never mind. Never mind. Now it's just you're one of us. You're one of us. <laughs> oh, God. Okay, but yeah, like, how are you giving me so many feels, like, all the ways to, like, I initially, besides recovery of MMO Junkie and freaking Love is Hard for Otaku, um... It also gave me, if I can go back and look at it, what the fuck was the name? No, that's not it. It's probably because of the fact that I've already completed it and it's like, mother effer. Hold on. I'm going to find it. Yes. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Not that way. No. <laughs> Let me try my other one. Um, Freaking, what the heck was the name of that freaking show that I watched? 
No, no, yes. Okay. Um, the and of course it's in Japanese. Mm -hmm. The the uh the ice guy and the cool female colleague. There we go. How did I remember that so quickly? Um, but it's more like, of course, yes, the female is the one that we're seeing the POV of instead of the male, even though I love back and forth when you get to see romance series going back and forth between that. I think it's cute because it's very nice to also get different POVs on it. So I am kind of hoping that there is one episode where Yamada Kun is, you know, the POV for instance. I would like that. Yeah. Um, what? <laughs> What can I say about Yamada? Um, <laughs> he, he's um, he, he's just the typical regular gamer guy and stuff. I mean, yes, he is the guy, the guy that is like, I am more into gaming than I am into like anything else, and that's all he cares about. I get it. I have met guys like that. I have friends like that and such guys, girls, whoever, you know, we all have that one thing that we all care about and we're just like, yeah, everything else in the world, I really don't give a fuck about but damn i mean but seriously thank you for hiring that say you to play him because like oof big oof because <laughs> if you didn't know now i have a fucking crush on that man too but <laughs> i digress i mean seriously they are both cute together they are adorable i mean seriously as i said in my tweet before i even watched this because i was sitting and watching um a super eye patch wolf video and i was like i'm gonna watch this and i'm gonna watch this and then i gotta watch pretty here and i looked at the girl and i was like oh i'm about to relate so much to this chick in the first episode i'm just like yep mm -hmm. that's me thank god i've never really had someone you know say like we end the relationship because he's falling in love with someone else in a game thank god that has not happened to me Ooh, i feel bad for her on that because that is so messed up like homeboy like literally left you for someone else in a video game damn like oh baby no 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 but i i love the fact that she was like yes i want to go shopping i want to like literally go to this event to just you know be like oh yes i am the greatest thing that you literally said no to that you were missing in ish and yeah mm -hmm. give me the new girlfriend you're like oh my god like oh my god just so freaking pretty and then look at me average is f <laughs> so sad <laughs> it really is but seriously this is just the start of a beautiful friendship slash you know future boyfriend girlfriend relationship between these two i mean honestly you know when they get married and have kids they can't you know when their kids ask hey mom dad how'd you meet you know they explain and then you be like yeah well mommy got really drunk one <laughs> like hella drunk but, oh my god yeah she's adorable I feel like we're going with Yamada, like, seriously, we're going to have moments where he is just strictly like, okay, Mana's home. And he's already like that in this first episode where he, you know how like some guys, and I can't speak for every single guy, but majority of guys that I've talked to, um, or even some girls that I've talked to and such, like as friends or whatever, or just like the guys that eventually I want to have a relationship with, I hate, like, hate, 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 where it's just one worded one freaking word it's like oh my god like seriously you can't give me the time to give me a whole freaking sentence but then sometimes like if i feel some type of way and such about maybe my day or just like the person or whatever yeah i do one word a sentence too so yeah you know they probably think the same way about me and be like mm, this girl over here <laughs> but other than that guys that is where i actually towards episode one of loving yamada -kun to level 999 if you, that is a mouthful to say once again if you guys enjoyed it please give me a like it really helps me out also subscribe to my channel i make videos every single day join the master squad and of course i will see you guys officially all um, next saturday even though i am on vacation i'm supposed to go somewhere but you know something happened and such but now i'm still here for episode two bye guys